to South Jersey. And a, a lot of people ask me, where are you from? Because I've been around the world. And I talk about my hometown of Wooly Girl, New Jersey. But you know, there's something you guys probably do not even really know. You know I used to go to uh, preschool right here in Mount Holland. And I went to kindergarten in Pemberton. So I, I, I was from Willingboro, but actually I'm really about South Jersey. And the things that I learned in South Jersey, I took with me all around the world. Because if, if anyone knows about school, I know about school. Um, both of my parents were teachers and they worked in the Willingboro School District. And when I saw that community, I saw people that had dreams. And then my parents started the Willingboro Track Club. And if it wasn't for that, you probably wouldn't even know me. I'm here to announce that I'm going to run for State Senate in the 8th District. And when I run, as you see my uh, record, I run the win. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> what, what are the things that I've noticed in the community, especially after growing up, is we're, we're, we're getting into a, a culture of mediocrity where people think it's okay to be average where you don't push yourself beyond yourself to be better than yourself. You just think, it's okay. It's hard, so let me stop. Well, it's our opportunity to inspire young people, to inspire families, to lift up seniors, to help everyone get to where they want to be. Because it's our opportunity. I've, I've walked in track meets, I've walked in schools, I've talked places, I've gone to senior centers. I've done it all because, you know, that's just how I was raised. And another thing I realized is taking this step there are going to be people that step up and get on the attack. But you know what? I've been around the game a long time. And the only thing you can be is honest and be yourself. And the one thing that my late father left me was taught me to do what you think is right. Do what you think is right. Follow your heart. I'm going to knock on as many doors as I can. And when I knock on a door, I'm not just going to ask you, what are you thinking? What are you feeling? What are your issues? Because I want to know that. But I'm going to ask you to come out. Come outside. Because you know what? I'm going to be running. Now, I'm going to let y'all know now. I'm slower than I used to be. So you can probably <laughs> be but I'm going to be running. I'm going to be running for the children. And I'm going to be running for the parents, I'm going to run for the families. So if you see me in your community, I want you to come out and run with me. I want the kids to run with me. I want the schools to run with me. I want the communities to run with me. I want the parents to run with me. I want the grandparents to run with me. I want everyone to run with me. And you know what we're going to do? We're going to run, and we're going to gather, and we're going to get together, and we're going to have a message, and we're looking for the future, and we're thinking about where we're going to go, and we're going to change where we've been. You know, your past is a part of you but it doesn't have to define you. We're going to change, and we're going to deal with the issues that we have in New Jersey and deal with the issues that we have in our community. And when we get our whole group together, we're going to be running together. We're running straight to training. <laughs>